Hey everyone, I'm Captain Forest Falcon. Welcome back to Summon Knight Swordcraft Story 2 Blind. Uh, let me see. I think I'm okay. Uh, I'm assuming that there's probably a boss, like, right, right up here. Like, that's why I ended off where I did that last episode. Um, but who knows, maybe I, maybe I'm just a bit too ahead of myself. I'm not sure if it's, like, the end of this, but I feel like, oh, yeah, sure enough. Like, I feel like there's got to be, like, one boss, like, maybe this is the mid-boss of this area, and then we have to go a bit further, and then we fight someone else. What's this? I'm starting to feel sick. Can you feel it, too? The presence of something. Gora's Hall must be ahead here. Uh, but I can't see Lin here. I'm sure they are watching us from somewhere close by. Where are you, Lin? I know you're here somewhere. I knew you'd be able to notice me, Edgar. You become stronger. <laughs> Oren, Tatiana, are you guys okay? They've been exposed to Gora's energy, but they will recover. Lin, I finally chased you this far. Please let them go. I can't do that yet. I feel bad for them, but they need to remain here until Gora has been re revived. Lin, please, can't you stop this? Edgar, I... <sighs> Lin? It's the bond, isn't it? So, yeah, like, part of it does have to do with the fact that she was Gurren Summon Creature, and, like, some of this isn't, like, her own will. Like, so... That's right. I can't disobey. I have to do this. It's for Master Gurren and Gora. And you, your demon edges, and even part of your spirit. They all belong to Gora. Lin. Now open the door and take me to Gora. You can do it, can't you? Very well. Okay. <laughs> so, we're opening the path forward. Are we gonna see what Gora looks like? Oh, man. That's a nice way to go forward. Oh, man, that's like some Gygus vibes there. <laughs> finally. This day has finally come. Lynn. Do you really have to revive Gora? Please don't look sad, Edgar. Don't you know that it's humanity's fault that Gora is trapped like this? About that, though. My family, all of us who are related to Gora, we have all our powers diminished when Gora was stolen from our world and brought here. Master Gurren heard a story that said that Gora could be revived. So, they're actually related, in a sense, to Gora. Ryuga and uh, Lin. So it's not like just, oh, Gurren chose anyone. He actually chose someone specifically from where Gora came from uh, to help him with this. And the more he researched it, the more possible it became. But Lin, if we revived Gora, yes, he could do anything to the humans here. Do you think it's wrong to seek revenge on the ones that wronged you? Those who kidnapped, imprisoned, and tortured you? But I'm done debating with you. Even now, Gora's power is enough to affect humans above. Ugh. It's too late now. We don't have any other options. Oren, I need you to break the seals on the demon edges. Do it, or Tatiana dies. Oh, Edgar. I'm sorry. I'm the reason you're doing this, aren't I? Hey, I know it's not your fault, Orin. So I guess I have a choice. Do I have to break the seals on the demon edges? So you still have a choice. Do I? Eh. Oh yeah, Dinah has the radio. I just hope we can reach Gabriel and Zeride. Oh boy. Oh boy, what a choice. Because gosh, what if uh, we signal now and... Lin just notices and it all goes to heck. Like, is there actually, like, a, a choice that could result in something really bad happening here? It feels like unsealing the Demon Edge would be a bad thing to do. But... It feels like giving the signal would probably be good before things get much worse, if we can. But I have a bad, horrible, horrible feeling that things could go wrong if I do this. 
But are we gonna get another chance to signal to Dinah? What if we just unseal uh, the Demon Edge and everything goes wrong? I'm gonna give the signal. Dinah, don't screw this up. You have one job. Please, please do something. Is there anything wrong with you, Edgar? Yeah, yeah, I'm totally not uh, gesturing wildly over towards a uh, completely oblivious Dinah right now. What do you think? Of course there's something wrong. I'm free, Gora. We don't have a choice. We have to break the seal. <laughs> okay, I guess I guess we couldn't actually do anything there. I just was wondering if it's like if maybe doing something like that, you know, could result in like a bad ending or something. Ah, I can feel Gora's energy growing. On to the next one. Give a signal to Dinah, unseal the demon edge. Sure, okay then. Maybe there's like some sign from her that things are, uh... Let's see... Tatiana doesn't seem to be doing so well. You'd better hurry up. Two swords to go. Uh, okay. We're up to three. And Gora's getting mad. Oh, are you all right, Orin? Yeah, I'm still hanging in there. This power, I don't feel so well. Gora's energy, it's astounding. Now the final sword. This is the last one. Dinah, do something. She might be distracted enough. Okay. This is it. The last one. Okay. <laughs> Gabriel again. Gabriel, the, the our resident backstabber. <laughs> Just every situation now. Gabriel, I will stab whoever is bothering you in the back. <laughs> Gabriel, maybe Gabriel is actually like, uh, he's like another version of Shulk. Just backslash! <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Tatiana, hurry, over here. Nina? Ugh! Take care of them for us, Gabriel. Go with them, Oren. Sh sure, no problem. Okay, they just came in here so Zerai doesn't get to actually be here for us? You've rescued your friends, but now that the seals have been broken, I don't need them anymore. Now, Edgar, return the last demon edge to Gora. No, I can't do that, Lin. I told you, I'm strong. If I have to take it from you by force, I will. Gora's power is with me. I won't lose. Also, we haven't seen Gedorm yet. That's concerning. Lin, please don't make me do this. Give your power to me! Lin! No. I'm still held by my bond to Master Gurren. I can't stop it. What is... What are you holding? Uh, yikes. Uh, that's kind of... Terrifying, honestly. Dang it. Okay, let's heal up. She's lose. Okay, so she's got some weapon durability. Uh, I don't know if I can get this off fast enough. Like, man, it feels like really hard to do it. Okay, she's she's doing the whole uh, Blair running thing. Is she actually, like, concerned about get losing her weapon durability like this? Is that why she keeps running like this? Is it just like... Oh boy. Like, getting in the corner is, like, concerning. <laughs> is it just me, or is it... Or are they trying to just get me to, like, use up all my durability on this? We're, we're not gonna be able to do this the entire way. Because our weapon durability is almost up. 
but we'll get halfway. Dang it. Uh, and back off now. Okay. Oh, right. Oh, that's your voice, Lin, is it? <laughs> it's useless. Oh, man. I'm so glad I was just out of range of that. Okay. Oh, this is like a range attack. And it, d it uses up way too much durability. I can't afford to use that. Oh man! There we go, that's what I wanted. Dang it! Oh, come on, really? I'm literally drilling into you and you can just get a skill off? Oh man, she, she is just so fast with that. Back off. Back off. <laughs> That's kind of funny. He's just like, run away to heal. And she's just like, I'm coming for you. Okay. Dang it. It's just like so many times she just like... How does she counter me every time? Oh my gosh. Seriously, back off. <sighs> okay, we've got like... Here you go. Okay, we've got like one more skill. And then we're gonna end up in like our uh, final form. Actually, she's using like a lot of durability when she uses that, isn't she? I kind of just... It's also like she's losing a lot of durability. Like, I swear, she's, like, losing two at times. Yeah, she uses a lot of durability when she uses that skill. So, that makes this a bit faster than just, you know, straight up doing the one-at-a-time thing. I think we've got it, though. I think we can just guard the rest of this. Although, uh, this is a bit bad. Uh, let me heal, let me heal. Let me heal, please! Come on! Oh, that was close. Okay. Let's switch to the axe now, because we've... Stop that! Stop using all your things! I need to get closer to her, I think. Okay, would you stop that? Please? Let's see. Okay. Oh no! She just put something to guard her weapon durability. Okay. I can wait. I can wait this out. As long as she doesn't use her skill. I just need to stay close enough to her. And keep perfect guarding. She'll eventually use it up. She'll eventually use it up and I'll be able to do something. Okay, I got through it. So, whew. hopefully she doesn't use that one again, because my gosh. Because I need, I don't want to use my, my gem here. I do not want to use it. Also, is that like Gora in the background there? In that crystal there? Okay. Come on. So many perfect guards. Lin, I've pra this is what I practiced against the Block Knight for. This is what I practiced for. All the perfect guarding. So many perfect guards. All the way. Come on. She's like... It's interesting, I think they sometimes get a little bit hesitant to attack you when their weapon's almost broken, but we did it! Oh, that... I really need... Hopefully, if there's a break-in battle, I need to, like, recover my weapon's durability, because it is toast after that fight. 
Nice 10,000 experience. Got some level ups. Okay, let's get some defense. Yeah, we've got 100 attack. Let's put it into defense. We got a witch stone. Okay. I regret that. You're stronger than I thought. You'd won, Edgar. Lynn. And you're still as kind as ever. Despite the fact that you had to beat me in order to save everyone, you still wanted to save me. I felt that during our battle. Thank you, Edgar. Gora's not gonna have any of this. Gedarm is gonna come. Huh? Hey, wait, Lynn! She's not done yet. Thank you very much, Edgar. Edgar, you let your guard down. She's gonna just take it from you, right? But... I need the Demon Edge back now! What? Yeah. <clears throat> you can't do that, Lynn. Only I can handle the swords. Ugh. Lynn! Gora will be revived. With this, I got all the swords gathered. Lynn, are you alright? Oh boy, it's... It's freed, it's like a... Ugh. It's kind of like a Bowser type of guy right there with all the spikes there. Ugh, Gura's power is... Hey Edgar, are you okay? We gotta get out of here now! No, he's trying to trap me down here with him! Edge... Fen... You! The Edge Fencer! My time has finally come. I will have my revenge. You, your. It's time to regain the peace of Gora's spirit within you, and then take your body as a vessel. Gora? <laughs> That's it. And now, you're mine. No, he's taking over my body. Finally, I'll get to have invincible power. Who are you? This voice. Who are you? Are you trying to take over my other half? Aha! You must be the piece of Gora within this Edge Fencer's soul. I'm not trying to take you over. In fact, I want to restore you to the rest of Gora. And I will, if you promise to use all your power to serve me. Is. Oh, I, I was actually thinking this. I was actually thinking. This is like Gurren, isn't it? So, <laughs> if you will be bonded with me, me, Master Gurren. Roar! What am I feeling? It's like an argument was going on inside my head, but the voices weren't mine. Don't lose your head, Edgefencer. If you're haunted... <laughs> What's that voice? Is it like... Hey, Edgar. Is it his, uh, or it's Dinah? Edgar. What's that? What was that glow just now? Oh boy. Dinah! You came back. You really made me worry. Now, I know Gurren didn't want to revive Gora because of Lin's family. He just wanted to gain power for himself. Yeah, like, personally, I would think that I just felt like he was just manipulating Lynn, in a sense, or... Like, he just chose her for the t the attachment. I don't know. Something like that. You pesky edge fencer! Just give me your body before it's too late! Submit to Gurengora! <laughs> Gurengora! <laughs> what a great name! Oh, boy. Uh... Are you... Please tell me I don't have to win this! Please tell me I don't have to win this. I am not ready for this fight. I'm not ready for this fight. Help. Help me. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Just go to town on him. But I don't know. We just have to do like a certain amount of damage. Just hit him. Hit him a lot. Hit him a lot. Go, go, go. We gotta go fast. Wait. Here we go. Here we go. 
Our ultimate move does nothing. Oh gosh, we gotta hit him so many times, don't we? Oh, come on, really? Please tell me I don't have to actually survive here. Please tell me it's not like... Dang it! If he gets one more hit on me, I'm like dead. Oh, oh my gosh. Please tell me, like... Was that, like, one where I could have lost? Because I think that I'd heard, like, the last time, the final boss, there was, like, an invincible phase, and, like, uh, he could actually kill you there. If I died there, would I have game over? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel like I might have. I feel like I might have just done enough damage to him. Oh, that, that was way worse than just stumbling into the next phase. <laughs> It'd be funny, though, if I actually couldn't have died there. And it's like, this time I'm like panicked. Oh, no, I could have game over, but I didn't. No, I can't hurt him at all. That's not his body. It's just some of his evil energy. Your attacks won't work on me. Just realize that you're doomed and give yourself to me. Stay away from us. Ugh. What's that? What's this eerie glow? Dino, what in the world is going on? Who knows? Let's just get out of here. But what do we do with Lynn? Edgar, come on, hurry. Gabriel. You can't escape me. Ugh, this word has suddenly become stronger. Tumai, he's a lifesaver. Now, hurry up, you two. Oh my gosh, was Tumai actually... Right on. Hurry up, Zeride. Roger that. Fortunately, Lin gets left behind. I will break through this ward, and you will be mine, Edge Fencer. I will soon breach this ward. You're only delaying the inevitable. Okay, so... Well, we faced Lin... We faced Gur. We figured out that Gurin is his spirit is like still has kind of merged with Gora, so they're kind of like yeah they they literally became Gur and Gora. <laughs> but the part of us I think is still like uh, attached to uh, the original Gora, and so that part of us I think is still like kind of good. I think Gora is actually good. I think it's just like being taken over by Gurin. To be manipulated for being used for bad. Kind of. So anyway, basically, I we're gonna deal with this next time, and it very well might be the finale at this point. <laughs> so we'll see. We might actually have one episode uh, before we finish things off, but if not, maybe next time's the finale. So thank you all so much for watching. May you soar like the amazing falcons you are, and have a wonderful day. Peace out.